pa kami nagising ngayon kasi magfly na naman kami uh, papunta sa Iguazo Falls. Uh, it will be around um, two hours flight from Buenos Aires to Iguazo. And, uh, but today we will be crossing the border. Uh, we will go to the Brazilian side. Uh, kaya maaga kami ngayon. Uh, Mag-backpacking lang kami guys ngayon at uh, mag-iwan kami dito ng maleta sa hotel at saka mag-rent kami uli ng another na natirhan doon sa Iguazu for two days. Kaya guys, uh, we're getting ready to leave. We will see you there later. It is very disorganized here at EZE Airport. About 90% are tourists and each and every one speaks different languages. Buenos Aires has two airports, the Ministro Pistorini International Airport or EZE and George Newberry Airfield or AEP. They say that EZE is very chaotic and rightly so it is. So guys, if you travel from Buenos Aires domestic flight, try to use the AEP airport. Finally boarded and took off for Iguazu Falls. So guys, we just arrived at Iguazu Airport. Please come with us and we will share with you what we see. So guys, we hired a taxi to Puerto Iguazu. Kinaibigan namin ang taxi driver at naging personal driver namin siya for three days while we are here in Iguazu. At ang tawag sa Iguazu dito ay Iguaco. At ang salita dito sa Brazilian side ay Portuguese. At dinala niya kami dito sa um, visitor center kung saan kami kumuha ng ticket para sa falls. Ang gamit dito ay parang chaos o auto attendant machine. The park opens about 8 a.m. Kaya lang medyo late kami ngayon kasi sa Buenos Aires pa kami galing. Kaya pag pumunta kayo dito, medyo agahan ninyo kung andito na kayo nakastay sa Iguazu. Uh, we are going to the park using this bus which will take us from the visitor center to the park. Tarde da concessionária Urbia Cataratas para sua segurança. So we are here now guys at the Iguazo Falls, Brazilian side. We can hear the um, falls now. There we go, we are here in the rainforest. Here Hello go, guys. guys. It's a little balmy. It's really hot. It is hot here, it's in the 90s. And the fall gives uh, additional humidity, but we're braving it. It's not bad. Not bad. Mas uh, mainit pa dyan sa Pilipinas, talaga. We're used to the weather in Texas and in the Philippines, so no big deal. Oh, over here, you can see it now. Right there. So guys, ang Iguazo Falls from Brazilian side, first viewing area. Ang ganda. Waterfalls flowing from one level to another. Ito guys, ang makikita sa pangalawang overlook scenic viewing. This looks awesome guys. It looks like curtain of waterfalls. Summer ngayon guys, kaya uh, medyo konti ang tubig. Mas maganda ito pag uh, rainy season. Kaya lang, ngayon ay summer, kaya medyo ko konti lang ang tubig sa falls. The surrounding rainforest is also home to about 2,000 species of vascular plants. Nako guys, ang daming lalakarin. May paakyat, pababa, at saka may mga areas din na medyo matarik ang aakyatin. Ang kagandahan dito guys, habang naglalakad ka, 
uh, maririnig mo ang napakaraming iba-ibang huni ng mga critters katulad ng sikada at saka ang thundering sound ng fog. Ito guys, ito kami naglalakad. Parang nature walk. Ang ginagawa okay, namin lang ngayon. Pakasalilim ka, hindi naman gaano na yun. Okay. Yeah. Pero pagka yan sa ano, sa may, sa may araw. So they have the higher level and lower level falls. Iguazu Falls is the widest falls in the world. It spans 2.7 kilometers and is made up of 275 falls or cataracts. This is considered one of the most spectacular waterfalls in the world. It is a chain of waterfalls that is fed by the Iguazu River. This phenomenon sits on the border of Argentina and Brazil. The surrounding subtropical rainforest is home to giant anteaters, polar monkeys, jaguars, ocelot, and caimans. With about 275 falls or cascades, Ang waterfalls na ito ay napakagandang tingnan talaga. This national park is a World Heritage property and is about 670,000 hectares. It is beautiful up here at the top. You could see the surroundings. It is hot but breezy. Dito sa baba guys, ang sarap kasi mararamdaman ang talsik ng tubig. Napakahirap akyatin ito guys, but if you enjoy nature and are able to do moderate to strenuous activities, this is for you. We are back at the station guys from the falls. So tomorrow we will go to the Argentine side of the falls. Okay, see you again tomorrow. Bye. Our ride is here guys and we are very tired. Hope you enjoyed the falls. We will see you tomorrow at the Argentine side.